Mm. Next page. So away he went, skitter scatter over a shiny gray rock and past the big black beetle. Well. <laughs> This is next page. Down a gravelly hole and up the other side, where a sleepy lizard was dozing in the sun. Open. <laughs> next page. Through some prickly grass where a spider was weaving a web, and all the time his head said, To the sea, to the sea. Bulaka. <laughs> Bulaka. Next page. Doink. He crept into the shade of a big green leaf to cool down, and as he cooled, the words in his head slowly came back again. To the sea! To the sea! Oh, I skipped a page. Oopsie. Lol. Well, no, I have to read that page. Eh. That's. Yeah, it, is, it was stuck. The sun was burning down on the smallest turtle and made him too hot and a mat hot and muddled the words inside his head. His he began to go round and round in circles. <laughs> so on and on went the smallest turtle until he stopped to rest. He was getting very tired. Suddenly, he heard something. It was the sound of waves crashing and hissing onto the sand. The, wor the words inside his head became stronger than ever. To the sea! To the sea! What? But there was danger. Gulls were wheeling and whirling up in the sky, looking with beady, greedy eyes for a baby turtle lunch. The smallest turtle didn't wait. Down the scorching sand, he scrabbled and skittered. Faster, faster. Away from the gulls, past the crabs, over the seaweed, over the shells, and... At last, he felt cool, cool water on his hot, tired, sandy body. And as he swam down, 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 he knew. It's the sea, he sang. It's the sea. Wow. <clears throat> Bye-bye.